I help you? Mr. McDaniel? Yeah, who wants to know? I'm Detective Dan Boswell. And this is for you. It's a PFA, Mr. McDaniel. It's a protection from abuse court order. Your wife filed that earlier today at the courthouse. I guess you guys had a little domestic altercation last night? Hey, it's Gloria. Sorry I missed your call, but leave me a message and I will get back to you. Bye. Hey, it's Gloria. Sorry I missed your call, but leave me a message and I will get back to you. Hey, it's Gloria. Bye. Sorry I missed your call, but leave me a message and I will... Okay, good. Call Tara. Call her. I'm not going to ask you again. She's probably okay, here. Give me, Chill. Give She's probably sleeping. Oh, sleeping? Okay, well, let's just wake her up, okay? Let's just do that. Why is your phone off? Why is your phone off? Anthony, the battery was dying, so I cut it off. Turn it on. Call Tara. Put her on speakerphone. Put her on okay, speakerphone. All right, I'll call Aunt. Please, Put calm down. Calm down. Down. Calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. Do you see what time it is? Huh? Yes. What time is it? What time is it? Three. Three? No, it's four fucking thirty. In the morning. Four thirty! Of course you wouldn't know that. Look at you. You look like shit. Oh, I... You look like shit. It's look at okay. that. It's okay. Anthony, stop. Call her. Who's Derek? Coworker. Coworker? Yes. Okay, let me ask you a question. Why do you have his phone number in your purse? Anthony. Don't Anthony me. I want an answer. Because we work together, Anthony. So you need his phone number in your purse? It's, huh? It's nothing. Makes sense. Don't worry, you don't need it anymore. showed up I met your lovely wife she, she is she's beautiful you're a lucky man you did the right thing by leaving the residence you know it's good to cool off take a walk get your mind right we most likely would have taken you into custody but I guess it was good you weren't there I'm reading this thing. I still don't fully understand what's going on here. Well, let me see if I can walk you through this. That document states that you will not be able to be in contact with your wife for a year from today. That means over the phone, text message, email, mail, or in person. That 
it's insane. We just had a rough night last night. I mean, yeah, we've well, got more to talk about. You're just gonna have to hold that till this time next year. That's not possible, sir. I'm, I'm headed home now. Good, because actually, I'm here to escort you home to get your belongings. You see, Mr. McDaniel, if you violate that PFA, you will be going directly to prison for six months. No ifs, ands, or buts. I can't believe this bitch did this. It could be worse, sir. It could always be worse. Now I advise you, just play your part. that since tomorrow's Friday, your dad, we can get away for the weekend. I'm leaving for Canada tomorrow morning. Damn it, Anthony! Are you kidding me? Uh, no. I can't. You know, Anthony, there is no guarantee that I will be here when you get back. What is that supposed to mean? You always do this and I've had it! This last minute shit with you, Anthony, just taking off the next day and going? It doesn't cut it. I'm over it. Why are you being so dramatic about this? Dramatic. Anthony, come on, we need help. I just, I don't understand how you can't see that we're changing. We don't need help. Sure, we do need to spend more time together, and we will. As soon as I get back from Canada, I promise. And I promise you that I will not be here when you get back, all right? Don't you turn your back on me, listen. Oh, okay, <laughs> that's just, whew. Enough, if you love me, okay, and you want this relationship to grow, you better call in sick. Are you kidding me, Gloria? Does it sound like I'm kidding? I'm glad you came and worked out with me today. I needed that. coming out tonight. I really had a good time. Me too. Well, that's good. We got to do it again. Definitely. Definitely. Yes, please, please. Um, but it's getting late, so I'm going to head in, okay? Oh, wait. Well, you ain't got to go in yet. You can't You can't sit and talk with me for a little now, bit? No, aren't you just Mr. Persistent? Huh? It's late. It's late. It's late. No, I have an early morning. As so do I. I gotta, As do I. So I have to go in. So, But thank you so much, okay? You think I'm going to let you go that easily?
you toast. And how was your day at work? Uh, it was all right. Oh, yeah? What's wrong, beautiful? We're making a big mistake. What's wrong, Tony? Are you okay? Yeah, uh, never better. I just, I just think we should slow down. Are you serious, Tony? I like the pace we're going. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Um, you know what I'm going through right now. I just need to clear my head. Seriously, I thought that's what I was helping you do. Uh, listen, I don't, I don't mean to sound rude right now. Look, babe. I know it may feel like that now, but trust me, it's gonna happen. Uh, no. You need to leave. Okay. I understand. I'll go. Um, what? The best way you can help me, and you do want to help me, right? Yes, of course, Tony. Okay, I need to leave. Are you serious? Okay. Yeah. I'm fine. Have a good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Feel better. It's a feeling in a rush I feel Inside this pride Glory, 
Is that you? Anthony! <laughs> oh, I missed you so much. Uh. Listen, what you said to me months ago, you were right. I was so caught up in my own stupid selfish ambitions, I neglected you, I pushed you away, I took you for granted, and, and all you were trying to do was show me how cold I became. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Can you ever forgive me? I forgive you. Can you ever forgive me? I don't care what you did. I love you. That's all that matters. Every day I was trying to fill a void that only you could fill. I love you. I just went about it the wrong way trying to show you that. I never want to lose you again, okay? Just, I just want you to come home. Listen, I'm right here. Nothing's ever going to separate us ever again. I promise. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. I, uh, I got something for you over at the truck. A surprise? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, I love surprises. Wait here, close your eyes. <laughs> okay. Don't be peeking. I'm gonna turn around.